we got a great, fantastic day to celebrate the life of Sir Samuel Benfield Steele. A lot of people don't know who Sir Samuel Benfield Steele was. Well, he was a great Canadian historical icon. jacket is from the Royal Canadian Mounted Police. It's an authentic period jacket, uh, similar to what Sam Steele would have worn when he first joined the Mounties. He was the third member of the Mounties to sign up, so he, uh, he started with them at a very early age. The speech uh, that I'm going to use today was written by a local uh, author, and it is written in the first person, so I will be presenting my speech as Sam Steele to the congregation of the church. It's a history of Sam Steele's career and it's really quite interesting and I feel quite honored to, uh, to be able to use this speech to tell everybody about Sam Steele. Long even before this line of the Yukon set his unfired revolver in his desk and civilized the old hungry plotting. I, Steve Clark, Mayor of the city, along with my fellow councillors, do hereby proclaim Sir Sam Steele Day in the city of Aurelia. We bless this plaque as a memorial tribute and as a remembrance of this day to Sir Samuel Benfield Steele in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, St. James Anglican Church in our community. Born January 5, 1848, raised in then called Medonte, schooled in Aurelia, baptized at St. James Anglican Church, February 4, 1848. This mounted policeman, soldier, dedicated on selfish service, had a major impact on our nation and our nation's care for the world. Steele's first engagement in military history goes back to the forerunners of the great Simcoe Foresters. We have the Canadian Armed Forces here, OPP Pipes and Drums, Royal Canadian Legion Band. We got the Fire Department here, the Boy Scouts, which he was very much involved with over the years, and many others. And St. James Church here have just got on to this as well because this was their parishioner, and this is where he was uh, dedicated, baptized, and what a wonderful day we've had. Thank you. 